someone told me I could uh, discover uh, myself in the Blackwall Tunnel and if I just kept driving through it that I would find myself somewhere along this tunnel but all I found was emissions and soot and matter and brake lights and number plates and stressed out caffeine breathed city dollar hunters who were <clears throat> also looking for themselves in the Blackwall Tunnel because this is where it's at this is where it's at But for a live performance here on the Audio Files, BBC Radio Cambridge here, coming up from Tom Clark. My aim really as a musician is to, is to, is to keep on um, bridging that gap, you know, that between how you feel one moment, but you, you know, you can't always express it in day-to-day -day life, to, to being in a situation where you can just completely bring down all the barriers and just and just play and just express yourself and, and, and try and communicate that, you know, and, and just meeting other people who are doing it and learning and, and, and trying to constantly learn and change and, and develop as a musician. Um, that's really... I think a little sup from his goblet of dark musings and melodious musical stirrings. It's my guest this evening. Performing live on the show, Tom Clark. <laughs> All right, <laughs> All right there, Tom. Good evening. How are you, my friend? I'm fine. Now we're not going to fall out already because I made some comments on the web page about your hair. It just looked like a perm. Yeah, fair enough. Okay. What are you going to play for us this evening? Well, tell us a bit more about yourself for a start. Where you, where do you hail from? Uh, Essex. Essex. Mid, mid, midway Essex, somewhere. All right, and you've performed here quite recently, haven't you? Where did you yeah, last play? Uh, the Boathouse. Oh, in, in Cambridge? By the river, yeah. All right, how did that go down? Because it's quite an intimate affair. You yes. can squeeze 40 people in there at yeah. the most. <laughs> no, it was, a nice, it was a nice venue. Um, it wasn't a big turnout, but I think it was, I think all the students had gone home for the year. So yeah, okay. The summer. All right, so uh, let's go straight to live music. We'll find out more about you, how we can get hold of uh, some of your stuff on iTunes. But what are you going to play for us first, Stephen? Okay, this song's called 34-7. Okay, this is Tom Clark performing live here on the Audio Files. then to where I am now. Um, lots and lots and lots of money down the drain. Nah, I take that back, not money down the drain, but lots and lots of time that I never had. Um, lots and lots of hours of driving and picking people up and driving up to London and gigging and tr making sure people come to rehearsals and just when you think it's all about to fall flat on its face, you just try and convince people one last time, you know, to come get a rehearsal together, and then you know, you, you things start to work, and then you gig, and then your band splits up, and then you you float along a bit longer, and then you start another band, and you know, and, you, and I kind of did that for four or five years, and then once I could, once I knew what I wanted to do personally, you know, I. I and and had and once I had the ability to do that, you know, it was. I just felt like doing it, you know, just be able to do what I wanted to do. And, and I think in a band situation, unless you get the right group of people, unless you get the right chemistry, um, it can be very hard to work with some, you know, with people for a long period of time, you know, and to produce music that you're ha still happy with, you know. So. Where do I see myself going? Um, 
I've no idea, but I'm looking forward to it. <laughs>